yeah, so it has been a couple of days since I have started this project. Um, it has been fully painted and lacquered, um, as you can tell from like the glow, sheen, whatever. Um, I am going to be trying something I have never done before. Um, this step is completely optional. I just decided to go out and buy. I just decided to go out and buy one of these glass finished kits. Um, I've never tried this before. My dad has, and I thought I would give it a go on a table that I painted um, a couple of months ago, but I never got around to it. And I thought that this would be the perfect opportunity to try it out. Like I said, this step is completely optional. You don't have to do it. Um, I quite like the look of it just painted and varnished, um, but I thought I'd give this a go and I I hope I don't fuck this up because this, this could go very badly. So in this kit, it is a two part epoxy. You get, you get two bottles um, of a finisher, the resin and a hardener, which is these. You get a little wooden stick to mix it and a pamphlet of how to actually use the product. I have quickly read the product and basically just work out how much surface you want to cover. You mix up the appropriate amounts in a disposable container, cup, whatever, and then you apply it on. Um, it also says that you need to have a butane torch or a torch like that um, to get the bubbles out. I do not have that, so we are just going to be winging this completely unaided. Also, I highly recommend that you use protective equipment. Um, if you do end up using this, like with the primer um, that I used beforehand, I did it outside, I made sure it was well ventilated. Um, please, if you're going to be doing this indoors, I highly, highly recommend that you use protective equipment such as a gas mask and gloves. Um, I'm doing this outside, this is my garage, so just that. Alright, let's get to it.